Looking ahead, um, Northampton, you had a chance to have a, have a look at them. What do you make of them? <clears throat> well, they're not too dissimilar from last year. Um, the big side, uh, physically powerful side. Um, they've got a bit about them. Um, you know, when you say physical and powerful, it, it suggests one way, which is not always the case. Um, they've got some good players, um, and they're on a good run. So we know it's going to be a stiff test, a stern test, but one that we're looking forward to. You know, I think Charlie Coke has been talking about sort of the the away form and and sort of the the turnaround. What do you put that down to? It's not it's not as easy as saying oh it's just this. I said I've done that 18 months ago. <laughs> um, it's it's a whole multitude of factors, um, none more so than they're all 12 months older. Um, that's important, but they all. They all understand that what's required, how it how it how it's how it happens. You know, you, you can't underestimate the, the victories at Mansfield and Swindon and Stevenage and MK Dons last year. And and how the, the performances were there last year, away from home. They were some of the performances were terrific, better than home performances. Um, so the, you know, you've got to, in the end you've got to, you've got to win the games and that's where we fell short. So, you know, there's when, when you when you stick with players and human beings, and you you you're constantly trying to help them. Eventually, if you know, they will come. They will get better certainly. And, and our boys away from home are coming good at the minute. And when you're winning on the road, there's confidence there. So they're taking that not only home away. Yeah, of course. It's it's we're in a, a good place at the minute. Obviously, we have. Those last two results haven't been brilliant, but we, you know, the, the Colchester game was a real tough game, and I, was, I thought it was one of the, the best games we've, we've been involved in. And obviously, to lose to Vale was was a bit of a blow, but um, you know, we're still fourth in the league, and we've got to go to Northampton and make sure we we show everyone why we're, we're fourth in the league. And looking a bit further ahead, um, FA Cup, you know um, who, who you've got, but um, it's going to be a, a few more people watching you. It's, it's great that we're on TV. Um, we'll find out next Tuesday who we've got, and we'll cross that bridge. But there's a couple of real, real important games before then. And obviously, with with TV comes a financial boost. Is that something that sort of plays in your mind at all? It don't play on my mind, but it's important. I know the value of it, um, both metaphorically and actually physically, the, the, the actual figure. Um, yeah, we've got to make sure that we win games of football so that we get more money into the football club, however that may be, whether that's TV money or game receipts or merchandise on match day or sponsorship or whatever. We've got to make the product of Crow Alexandria more attractive. That's our job. Um, is that my sole focus? No, of course it's not. My sole focus is to make the players better and to try and make them win. But on the back of that comes all the, the, the elements that I've just spoke about. So being on TV is important, but like I said, we've got two, three, in fact, three big, in the forest green, three big league games before then.